not the end crochet. I'm bringing to you a diamond painting report. And I've made, for the past week, I've made several videos. But every time I would make a video, i buy something. Or something to come in the mail from Amazon or wherever I would buy it from. it pop up. So I said, well, instead of making several little videos, let me make just one good size video to catch you up on my diamond painting experiment. I don't think so. This is way past experimenting. This is, okay, I'm actually doing this. So let's see what did I get. Let's see. I'll, I can't remember exactly what day I got what. I do know I got my light box. Peel it back so you can see it. Yesterday. And it plugs into my laptop. And it works real good because I used it yesterday and I had no idea how far off my drills were. I mean, all the ones I did the day before were off just a little, little bit. I could see the white part of the white circle. I said, well, that's not going to do. So I had to go back and like push and hold everybody in place until they settle. So glad I got that. That's a very penny. Got that from Amazon. And it's the size, the B4 size. I wanted to get a bigger one, but my space is very limited. So this is do until I can do better. What else did I get? This came today from Amazon. The trays that come with the kit ain't doing it. Uh, the drills won't shake out enough. And if they do shake out, they end up in the floor. I'm afraid my cat gonna eat one. So I got these. I got more glitter to make more um, decorative uh, stylus gel pens. I got that from Dollar Tree. Now, mind you, I got all this this one week. What is this called? It's an inter um, intermediate. It's called Rainbow Rose. That's that. You know, this one is surprisingly lightweight. I got this from Walmart. Sunflower water can. This is the one I was talking about. I was afraid it was going to be out of. So I got the last one. Okay. And today, I got everybody's favorite. Starry Night, uh, Vincent Van Gogh. I studied about Vincent Van Gogh, so of course I was going to get that. Let's see. What else I got this week? I got this container to hold all my odds and ends. I got this today from Amazon. I got this yesterday with the metal ends yesterday. Let's see. And I cleaned Dollar Tree out. Their little container. They ain't all of them. And I got some sealable bags. And I bought some extra stylus and wax from Hobby Lobby. And these are just extra trays that I got from wherever. I have no idea right now. And I did two more gel pens. And let me see. See, I told you, I got more. All oh, that's from Dollar Tree. Those little containers. And these, right here, I got four of them so far. They're from Dollar Tree. They were $1.25. Can you believe that? And one of them I got 
the drills from my first two kits. I ain't broke yet. <laughs> but I'm going to lay off of buying stuff for a while. What I was trying to do was to establish my setup. And I think I've done that. Hmm. If I can not lose my mind and grab every kit that I see, then I think I'll be all right. Let's see, now what do I plan to do with all of it? Well, once I get them done, I need to get some sealer. The bigger ones need to be sealed. The little one, on, on that I first one I did, I just went ahead and stuck it in a frame. And I saw this one lady, she said that if you put it behind glass, you don't have to seal it. So I don't know. So we'll see if they start popping out of there, which I doubt. Because they're, they're pretty good. Let's see. Yeah, I fixed the problem with me leaning over. Uh, it was hurting my back and my sinuses. Uh, I remember that I have a laptop table that raises and leans forward like an easel. My late mother bought that for me a long time ago, back when I first got into computers and I got my first laptop. That's been a while, but it still works. And it fits right. Well, it don't exactly fit, but I made it fit and stay still on my little table. So we're in business. But, uh, okay. That's what I did this week. I set myself up in diamond painting. And I'm thrilled. Really happy. Toodles.